Hello, my name is Frank. I'm here at the Lucky Shoals Park in Winnet County. In the year 2008, as I have mentioned on my other videos, Winnet County won the Golden Award for having the best park system in the United States, beating out uh, Las Vegas and Fort Worth, Texas for the Golden Award. This particular park has three indoor basketball courts, has an indoor badminton court, outdoor basketball courts, four multi-purpose youth fields, indoor walking track, a uh, restroom, has two lighted tennis courts, a pavilion, a playground, and a one mile paved uh, walking trail that we will get on in just a few minutes. It has restrooms and grill. Non-resident residents of uh, Gwinnett County uh, have to pay a double uh, to use the drop-off uh, open gym. So this is a wonderful park. The address here is 4651 uh, Britt Road uh, in North Cross, Georgia. It's just off Jimmy Carter, so it's very easy to find. So I hope you enjoy uh, today's walk together. Have a good day. We are here at the Lucky Shoals uh, Park in Gwinnett County for our morning walk. We get on. Now the trail zigzags around through this pine forest. Now the trail goes upward and to the left. The trail is. This trail has been repaved since we were here the last time. It's much easier on your. This trail runs beside a golf course on the right side up in the. It has been uh, around a year since I walked this trail before and since that time uh, approximately 950 people have seen my video on YouTube so it's one of the more popular parks in Gwinnett County now the trail uh, curves downward and to the left as we get into a uh, more into the forest now the trail uh, curves downward and to the right this is the uh, Lucky Shoals Community uh, Center up on this hill there it has an indoor run track on the second level and a gymnasium. Now the trail breaks into the sunlight and circles around by the basketball court. Now the trail uh, circles around to the left as we start going uphill into the forest again. Now we are behind the uh, basketball courts as we start the... The trail breaks to the right and then goes to the left uphill. Looks like we have a small dog here on the trail. It's good to see everybody's walking the trail. Now we go uphill and then we go to the right as we uh, walk further. In. Now we are getting more into a hard, uh, hardwood forest here with broadleaf trees. Now the trail uh, makes a 90 degree turn as it goes further uphill. And it's situated here uh, right by the parking lot in the back. At this point we can see the uh, basketball courts. Uh, that now we head uh, further uphill and then to the right. This walkway here leads directly into the parking lot for people that want to get on. Now the trail uh, goes uh, straight and then it curves around to the left uphill. We are coming down to a mile marker as we uh, make our way into the forest. We come down to the uh, three-fourths of a mile marker. And this trail is approximately about a mile in length, I think. This trail is about a mile in length as we go further into the forest. The trail uh, now loops around to the right. Now the trail uh, straightens out a bit as we uh, go further into the right. Some of the leaves here are really beautiful this time of year. Now the trail uh, breaks into a little bit of a straightaway uh, as we are now. Now the trail uh, loops around to the left and then it goes by the picnic tables. Here's another uh, break sidewalk that goes into the parking lot. The trail meanders upward uh, by the picnic table here in the woods. This noise you hear on the side is a schoolyard. I think they're having a recess right now, so the kids are out playing. As the trail uh, breaks upward a bit and then to the left, you can see uh, the schoolyard uh, through the woods there where the kids are playing. We have some beautiful red leaves here on the side of the trail. Now the trail uh, breaks to the left as we're going more into an open area at this point. We have a bit of a straightaway here that runs by the uh, pavilion, conveniently located there by the parking lot. Okay, we're headed further down the hill and then to the left as the joggers really enjoy this uh, wonderful day. 
Now we come to the uh, pavilion and the restrooms and the playground. Very uh, conveniently and well designed. This is a wonderful park. It's very well designed. Now the trail goes downhill and then to the right and uh, then the wiggles to the uh, left. Here we have uh, two more picnic tables by the trail. There's one further up on the left there. Now we go by a residential uh, uh, section here beside the trail. Somebody's out walking their dog on this very pleasant day. It's not too hot or too cold, it's just, just about right. There is a residential area uh, alongside the trail here as we make our way around the park. The trail uh, goes down a loop here and then it gets back into the forest as we see these beautiful dogs uh, coming up on us here. We love it. Your dogs are really pretty. <laughs> hey, appreciate it. Thank you. Have a good day now. Now we come out of the clearing that we just came through. Now we're headed back more into the forest at this point. Now the trail at this point breaks to the left as we're on fairly level ground. Now the trail uh, breaks to the left as we uh, go, start to go downhill at this point. We're overlooking the soccer field at this point. There's a park bench there that you can. Now at this point we uh, start downhill among these tall trees. Some of the trees really have beautiful colors this time of year. Looks like we have another jogger coming by. They pace. Now the trail uh, goes downhill and then it goes to the uh, left a bit. Now the trail uh, loops around uh, to the right and downhill. Here's uh, another soccer field, as you can see, as the trail loops around it and further downhill. The leaves are really beautiful, as you can see. The trail at this point goes uh, a little bit downhill and then it reverses to the left. At this point we're getting back into the new uh, repaving. It's really spongy and feels much better on your feet. You can hear the uh, grace uh, mowing equipment here on the other side of me. We come to the fourth mile marker here. I think we're walking this uh, trail in reverse right now. Now the trail uh, straightens out a bit and reverses to the uh, right up ahead. Now the trail breaks out of the open area and swings around to the right as we get more into the forest again. This stretch of the trail has the old concrete pavement. It's a little bit harder on your feet. I see we're getting into the newer repaving part of the trail at this point. This trail breaks into a straightaway. We saw a small uh, snake up here about a year ago on this part of the trail. Now the trail goes straight ahead and it breaks to the left on a little bit of a hill. Now the trail uh, goes uphill as we see uh, a park bench on the other side with these beautiful dogs that are coming by me right now. Now the trail uh, curves to the right and then wiggles around to the left as it meanders down through the forest. 